Yeah, I'm super happy to be back. It's it's just tennis paradise here, and um, I enjoy every second here. Hi, right, welcome. Good to see you. Um, in the past, you seem to be sort of soft-spoken and quiet, but obviously in our world now, there's this very, very difficult situation. In your heart, uh, what, what is your feeling? Mm, I feel um, really sad and really bad about Ukrainian uh, civilians who lost their homes during the war. Uh, yeah, I'm just really worried about it, and uh, but it's unfortunately it's not under my control, and I just hope for the peace, and uh, hopefully everything will stop very soon. Uh, Russell, Arena, tennis players from Belarus and Russia are obviously in a very difficult position at the moment through no fault of your own. What do you make of the fact that you're not able to represent Belarus here? You're not able to play under your own flag. Is that a fair decision? Mm, at least we can play. That's it. Do you understand why the decision was made? Um, I do understand, but I think it's not, it's not under our controls, you know? It's, it's not us. We're like... We also feel really sad and really bad about this situation, and that's it. It's 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 tough. It's tough moment for for everybody, and uh, yeah, I don't know what to say in this situation. Next question. Yep. What strategies do you have to? cope with the distractions so that you can be fully present on court like do you have any special like preparations that you do before the matches now to really get into that moment honestly uh, I'm not trying to look a lot in my phone right now because everything I see there it makes me really sad and every time I just pray for peace and that's it so I'm just trying to f focus on myself trying to do a good warm warm up uh, um, just to switch off from from the from the phone from the internet, and just focus on my game and do uh, do what I can and do my best. That's it. Next question. Oh, is it easy for the Ukrainians and the Russians and the Russians everybody to sort of get along in the tennis circuit? Because it's, you know it's a family that you're together all the time, so it's not a problem when a situation like this happens. I don't feel anything from from the Ukrainian players. Um, I think they understand that it's it's just nothing we can do about it, and uh, I still I still speak with all all girls, and we still kind of friends but it's right now everyone is just worried and it's not like everyone is really happy <laughs> uh in in the inside inside of our how to say like players area nobody's really happy like it's it's used to be uh everyone is just really worried but we still talk to each other and it's not like it's not conflict between us Do you feel you can show any support for Ukraine on the court? Would you be comfortable wearing the blue and yellow ribbon, for example? I will. It's, I mean, I can wear it and it's, I don't feel bad wearing it. I feel, I feel people need our support and I've, uh, I just hope that people understand that we, we all really worry it and we all really, um, I think even the word sad, it's not the right word, but we all, uh, how to say, we all care about them and we all, we all hope for, for the best and for the peace and wearing this, um, the, the, how does it call, yeah, the ribbon, it's, it's, it's nothing bad about it. I mean, I can, I, I'll, I'll be, I'll be comfortable wearing it. Next question. Yeah. Hi. Um, Mitchell Myers from Tennis Channel. I was just wondering, kind of getting back to the tennis of it. Um, yeah. <laughs> um, 
So obviously Barbora pulled out um, of the tournament. She was the top seed. So you're the highest seed in the draw now. Does that change your preparation for the event or? Not really. I still I still uh, have to show up and do my do my best and uh, try uh, try to do everything I can to win the match. <laughs> That's it. It's, it's not uh, it's not changing anything. <laughs> Can you say anything about this tournament that's special for you? Why? No, why this tournament might be special for you, and why it's different than most of the tournaments you play the rest of the year? Um, it's it's just amazing place. It's just beautiful. When when I open my window in the in the morning, I see all these mountains. I see the palms, and it just it just it's just paradise. Like, and it's so enjoyable to be here. Irina. Um, just a, a question about um, the serve a little bit, only because in Doha it seemed like everything was looking pretty good and you were serving quite well. And I'm just curious if, it, if that's how you felt as well, that all that's behind you. I think for the rest of my career I'll, I'll, I'll keep receiving all these <laughs> questions. <laughs> But um, yeah, I felt much better with the surf, and I um, I felt like I finally <laughs> finally found my rhythm. And yeah, uh, um, in Doha, I felt much better with the surf, and hopefully, I can um, improve it with, uh, with with every match I play. And, and it, it wasn't it wasn't perfect surf, it's uh, but it was much better than it was before, and I was really happy with that. And hopefully, here I can I can um, I can serve better. Just uh, last night at the, uh, the the exhibition that you guys played, you seemed like you were having a good time. I'm just curious about what your experience was like playing that event, and uh, and yeah. Uh, yeah, it was fun. It was fun playing. We we had a lot of fun with the girls, and uh, it was so nice to play in front of uh, everybody. And uh, it's it's felt unbelievable. Uh, we we just enjoy every every second there. And yeah, it was a lot of fun. <laughs> How important is it to have a sense of humor when you're having trouble with your surf? <laughs> I think this is the only thing which helped me to kind of uh, don't stay too much in, in this problem. So I kind of switch off for God. And, 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 and I think that's, that's helped me to uh, found my surf. <laughs> I think it's really important because if you take it really serious, it's, it's not going to improve and it's not going to help you at all. <laughs> Thank you.